Talking a sailboat can be a very scary and unsettling experience. You may feel like an actor on the stage and that the whole marina is your audience. In the first trial I did with a docking stick, you saw that the bow got pulled in rather abruptly. That's because I was running the line like this. I was running it through the fair lead that's probably uh, slightly forward of midships. And so that pulled in the bow. I mean, I wasn't overly concerned about it, but I got lots and lots of comments on that. So how do I intend to fix that? Well, one solution is just to move it back. I could attach a block here with a snap shackle and a block. That moves it back about two feet. Or even why not just right here? Just let this rope run around the cleat like this. And if that's not far enough back, and, and that'll just cause the boat to go in like this rather than like this. So we're gonna go give those a try. I have other options to do the same thing, a very simple solution to that. So let's give this a try, see how it works. Okay, just about the same conditions as the other day. There's about 10 knots of wind, not quite, 9 or 10 knots of wind, directly off of the pontoon. But I've moved the attachment for the, to, to drop the uh, pivot point back for the uh, spring line. Let's see how this works. We'll give it a try. A little less wind than the other day. Right, and I'm looking at uh, 7 knots now. 7 knots off of the dock. and helm away from the so the helm is turned to port and it just pulls it right back in parallel that you can dock your boat gracefully and with style and will provide you the tools and techniques you need to know in order to do so. Start by idling towards the slip as you normally would, lined up with the side that you want to dock on, and then slip the loop of the spring line over the tip of your boat hook. The other end should be girth hitched to the midship cleat as I have pointed out in the video. You want to be going as slowly as you can here, and then as you approach the cleat, simply reach out and slip the loop of the spring line over the cleat, and then turn the outboard tiller hard against the dock. The spring line will stop the boat before it hits the end of the slip, and the thrust of the outboard will push the stern of the boat towards the dock until it stops parallel.